Good morning and welcome back to the Tree of Life Crochet Along. We are on row number 35 for this video and it looks pretty simple. There are a lot of steps um, in the last video. There were 29, I think, steps and there are also 29 in for this row. Um, 29 steps per repeat and uh, it's going to be the front of the row so we'll be doing front post double crochets and I wanted to share something with you. I don't know if y'all noticed, but we are doing an experienced pattern. So you get to tell everyone that you completed an experienced pattern. I thought that was pretty neat. All right, and let's get started. Okay, and here are my written instructions, my little interpretations of part 25, row 35 of the trees graph. If you want to take a screenshot or um, copy it down, maybe pause it. Okay, we'll move it up. Okay, the first thing we need to do is two single crochets. Okay, I already have one. There's the next one. And we're going to skip the next single crochet right there. Just go right over it. Now we're going to do one front post double crochet. So yarn over. Start your workout to make sure you get on that top row. Go in and out through the front around that post. Make a double crochet. And now we're going to put one single crochet in top of the post stitch we just made. Okay, so don't yarn over. Pull your work forward just a little bit and you'll see this, the top of that post behind it and under it right there. We're going to put a single right into that V. Okay. And now two single crochets. Go into that first first single crochet right here. One and two. And we're going to skip the third one right there. And one front post double crochet. Yarn over. Okay. In and out through the front. Double crochet. And now one single crochet in top of the post stitch we just made. Okay, so same thing, pull it forward a little bit and you'll see that V behind it. Okay. Put a single crochet into that stitch. And now we need two single crochets into those singles right there. One. Now, one front post double crochet. Okay, there's the post. Yarn over. Go in and out through the front. Make a double crochet. Now, two single crochets. One and two. And now one front post double crochet around this post. Yarn over. Locate that post. Okay. 
go in and out through the front, double crochet, and now three single crochets. One, two, and three. And now we need two front post double crochets. Okay, around here and here. Yarn over once, locate the very first post go in and out through the front, double crochet, yarn over again and locate the very next post, go in and out through the front, double crochet, and now we need two single crochets, one and two, one, and two. Two front post doubles again around the next two posts. So yarn over, locate the first post, go in and out through the front, double crochet, yarn over and locate the next post, in and out through the front, double crochet. And now we need two single crochets, one and two. And two. And two front post double crochets. And they're kind of leaning this way, but they're easy to see. Yarn over, locate that first one, go in and out through the front double crochet, yarn over, locate the next post, in and out through the front, double crochet, and two single crochets there and there, one, and two and two front post double crochets, yarn over, locate the first post, in and out through the front, double crochet, yarn over and locate the next post, in and out through the front, double crochet, three single crochets, one, two, and three. One, two, and three. One front post double crochet right there, and it's kind of leaning to the right. Yarn over, go in and out through the front, and make a double crochet. two single crochets, one and two, and two, one front post double crochet again, yarn over, locate that post, go in and out through the front, and make a double crochet. And now two single crochets, one and two, and now we are going to put one single crochet in top of the next post stitch. Okay, so that very next stitch, put a single crochet right there, 
And now we're going to make a front post double around the post under the single we just made. So yarn over once and locate that post. It looks really short. Make sure you get in on the, the correct row right under the single. Okay. and make a double crochet. And now we are going to make, we're going to skip one single crochet and make two singles. Okay, so skip this first one and go into this one. One and two. Okay. And now one single crochet in top of the next post stitch. So right there, the very next stitch at the top, put a single crochet. And now we need one front post double crochet under the single we just did. So yarn over and locate that stitch, that post under the single crochet. Go in and out through the front and make a double crochet. And now we are going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Okay, so skip this first one, go into the second one. One and two. And that is the end of our first repeat. Look at the way it's branching out so much, it's so pretty. Okay, and now I want you to check and make sure your last single crochet is in line with your stitch marker. And we're going to start on our second repeat. We're going to make two single crochets, go right into the next stitch. One, two, and we're going to skip the third one. And we're going to make one front post double crochet. Yarn over and locate that post. Okay, make sure you go into that top row. And out through the front, double crochet. And now we're going to put a single crochet in top of the post stitch we just made. So pull it forward and you can see it halfway hiding right there. Okay. And we're going to put a single crochet right into that V. And now we're going to make two single crochets, go into the first single crochet. One and two, and we're going to skip that last one. And now we need one front post double crochet. Okay. Go around that post right there, yarn over, go in and out through the front, double crochet. And now we need one single in top of the post stitch we just made. Okay, so right there behind the post, follow it down to that V. Put a single crochet right in that stitch. and two single crochets, one and two, one and two. And now we need one front post double crochet around the next post, yarn over and locate that very next post, go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, and make two single crochets into these singles right here. One and two. And one front post double crochet around the next post. Yarn over, go in and out through the front around that post, 
make a double crochet. And now we need three single crochets. Go into that first single. One, two, and three. Two front post double crochets around the next two posts. Okay, and they're kind of leaning to the right here. Yarn over. Locate that first post. Go in and out through the front. And make a double crochet. Yarn over and locate the next post. Go in and out through the front. Double crochet. Now we need two single crochets, one and two. One and two. And now we need two front post double crochets around the next two posts. Yarn over, locate the very first post, go in and out through the front, double crochet. Yarn over and locate the very next post. Go in and out through the front. Double crochet. And now we need two single crochets. Okay, go into that first single right there. One. And two. Okay. Now we need two front post double crochets. Okay, right there and there. Yarn over, locate that first post, go into the right, it's leaning to the right a little bit. Go in and out through the front. Double crochet. And yarn over and locate the very next post. Go in and out through the front. Make a double crochet. Okay. Two single crochets. One and two. One and two. Two front post double crochets around the next two posts. Yarn over, locate the first post, go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, yarn over and locate the very next post, go in and out through the front, make a double crochet. Three single crochets. Okay, go into that very first single. One, two, and three. One front post double crochet around the next post, yarn over, and that post is leaning way to the right. Okay, see? Go in and out through the front around that post. Make a double crochet. And now two single crochets. One and two. One and two. And now one front post double crochet. Around that very next post, yarn over, locate that post, go in and out through the front. And when you're doing these, make sure you're not picking up that, lo that loop from the previous stitch right there. See right there? Go to the left of that little loop right there. Okay. It's kind of hard to see.
make your double crochet around that loop and now two single crochets right there and there one and two Now we need to make one single crochet in top of the next post stitch. Okay, so that very next stitch, put a single crochet right there. And right under the single we just made, we're going to make a front post double crochet around that post. So yarn over once. Okay, pull your work apart so you can see that post. Go in and out through the front. Make a double crochet and next is we're going to skip one single and make two single crochets so go into that second one one and two And now we are going to put a single crochet in top of the next post stitch. So that very next stitch, put a single crochet in it. And now we're going to put a front post double crochet around the post under the single uh, crochet we just made. So yarn over once, locate that post. Go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, and next is we're going to skip one single crochet and we're going to make two singles. So go into that second one, one, and two. Okay, that's the end of our second repeat. Alrighty and I want you to check it. Make sure your last stitch lines up with your stitch marker. Okay, and you can move your stitch marker up if you need to. I'm using such a uh, fine yarn that my project isn't going to be that huge, but if you're using worsted weight yarn, it's, a, it's gonna be a lot bigger. Okay, and now on to our third repeat. Okay, go right into that very next stitch for two single crochets. One and two. We're going to skip that last single. And now I need a front post double crochet around this next post. So yarn over, locate that post, go in and out through the front, double crochet. And now we need to put a single crochet in top of the post stitch we just made. Okay, so pull it forward and you'll see that V right behind that post. Okay, we're going to put a single crochet right in there. Okay, and now we are going to make two single crochets going to that very next stitch one and two and we're going to skip the next single crochet okay one front post double crochet around the next post and it's right there yarn over okay locate that post go in and out through the front double crochet And now we're going to put one single in top of the post stitch we just made. Okay, so pull it forward a little bit and you'll see the, that V. Put a single crochet right in there. And now we need two single crochets, one and two. One 
and two, and one front post double crochet around the next post, yarn over and locate that post, go in and out through the front and make a double crochet, two single crochets, one and two, one, and two, one front post double crochet around the next post, yarn over, locate that very next post, okay, avoid that little loop from the previous stitch, okay, I don't know if you can see it on camera, but I'm sure you can see it on your project, okay, so just pick up that loop in and out through the front, double crochet, and now we need three single crochets, go into that first single, one, two, and three, and now we need two front post double crochets around the next two posts, and they're kind of leaning to the right here. Okay, yarn over and locate that first one. Go in and out through the front, make a double crochet. Yarn over and locate the very next post. Go in and out through the front, double crochet. And now we need two single crochets, one and two. one and two. Two front post double crochets around the next two posts, so yarn over and locate the first post, okay, in and out through the front, double crochet, yarn over and locate the next post, go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, And now we need two single crochets, one and two, one and two. And now we need two front post double crochets again, and they're leaning to the right here. So yarn over and locate that first one. Go in and out through the front around that post, make a double crochet, yarn over and locate the very next post, okay right there, go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, and now we need Okay, and now two single crochets, one and two, one and two, and now we need two front post double crochets, so yarn over and locate that first post, and go in and out through the front, make a double crochet, Yarn over and locate the very next post, go in and out through the front, double crochet. And now we need three single crochets, go into that first single crochet, one, two, three, okay. Now we need one front post double crochet, yarn over, and it's leaning that way a lot, yarn over and locate that next post, go in and out through the front around that post, make 
like a double crochet. Okay, and two single crochets is next. One and two. One and two. And one front post double crochet in the next post. Yarn over and locate the next post. Go in and out through the front. Make a double crochet. Okay, and now we need two single crochets. Go into that first single crochet. One and two. And now we need to make one single crochet in top of the next post stitch. So that very next stitch, put a single crochet in there. And make one front post double crochet under the single we just made around that post. Yarn over and locate that post. In and out through the front. Double crochet. And now we are going to skip one single crochet, go into the second one and make two single crochets. One, and then the next one, two. Okay, and now we're going to put one single in top of the next post stitch. So this right here, this next stitch, put a single right in there. Okay. And now we're going to make one front post double around the post under the single crochet we just made. So yarn over and locate that post. Okay, and it's really leaning that way. Okay, go in and out through the front around that post and make a double crochet. And now we are going to skip one single crochet and make two single crochets. Okay, so skip that first one, go into the second one. One. And two. We did it. Okay, chain one, turn your work, put a single right into that first single crochet. We are ready for the next row. I will see you guys in the next video.